as Miles Michaelis is on the mound for St. Louis. And Michaelis trying to bounce back after a short start his last time out. Record of 10 and 10, the ERA at 348, but 18 quality starts put together here by Miles. And it's a fly ball out to left. Racing over Dickerson with room. He's got it. And the first out. Little tapper back to Michaelis on the 3 2. And on number two. That's ripped towards left. And that one will touch down. And that's going to bang up against the wall. Reyes racing for second. And Friend will swing it a good bat. A two out double. Ball one, no strikes with Reyes out there at second. And half at the dish. You're like, what's going on with this? Michael is to the bag. And the outs. And the Cubs strand a runner. We move to the home half of the first. Against Marcus Stroman. 3 and 6, 3.9 ADRA for the veteran righty. Good numbers for Goldie against Stroman. 7 for 15, three home runs. Unbelievable. And base hit into left center. And this guy can hit. Goldie thinking two on his way to second. The throw is not in time. And a two out double for Paul Goldschmidt. Popped up Horner backpedaling. Nico waves off half and Ortega makes the catch. Arenado retired. End of one in St. Louis, and there is no score at Bush. Corey Dickerson against right hander Marcus Stroman is hitting 432. Softly hit left side and under the glove of Morrell. Would have been a do or die play potentially, and the Cardinals have their second base runner. That's drilled out towards left center field. Half on the run. And he made the get catch. Wow. It almost spilled out of his glove. That's a really nice play. Well, he made a spectacular play last night towards the line and left. This time he goes into the alley. And the 0-2 pitch now to Nolan Gorman. Off the glove. In the center. Dickerson to third. That's a great read by Dickerson right there. Speaking of guys that have picked it up, Andrew Kisner. Now slowly to third, charging, gloving as Morrell, holding at third as the runner Dickerson. Now the throw to the plate. He's going to be doubled up. He waited too long, though, and he was cut down on a good throw by Rivas to the catcher, Higgins. As we go to the bottom of the third inning. Edmund hits it the other way. Diving stop. The throw not in time, and a base hit for Tommy Edmund. Like that. Runner goes, that's Edmund, and a ground ball hit right side. Getting back to the bag at first, Rivas. And Tommy advancing to second base. Goldschmidt a double to left center. First time up is 35th of the year. And a swing and a miss. He got him on the breaking ball. So Edmund leads off with the single, and then Stroman locks it down. Gets the next three in a row. Nine pitch at bat, and it ends in a walk. The batter now will be Ian Happ. 2-2 two -two pitch. Ground ball could be two. Arnato. Edmund, turn, got him. Double play. Exactly the right spot as the Cardinals turn the double play, sending us to the bottom of the fourth inning. Chicago nothing, Cardinals nothing. Corey Dickerson reached on an error his first time. He eventually was thrown out at the plate. He's been the closest player to score a run here today. And there's a swing and a looping liner down the left field line. That's another hit for Corey Dickerson against Stroman. He's trying to get the second. The throw there is not in time. A double for Corey Dickerson. And the Cardinals have another runner in scoring position. Marcus Stroman gets O'Neill a strikeout. There's two away. And a swing and a foul tip into the mid of Higgins struck him out. Stroman continues to do good work. Cardinals leave him in. We're at the end of four. Nothing, nothing. This is Rafael Ortega with one down in the fifth. There's a one-two pitch and a swing and a miss. And for Michaelis, his first strikeout of the afternoon. And the 0-2 struck him out looking, never swung the bat. Back-to-back -back K's for Michaelis, and we're midway through five. Anyway, sixth inning, nothing, nothing game. It brings up Christopher Morrell. The one-two lined in a shallow left center. That's going to fall in there for a base hit. A one-out single by Morrell with his speed. Let's see if that leads to a rally. Runner goes and the 2 1 line to left. Dickerson will make the catch and his throw back to the bag at first, not in time. The kick, the pitch. There's a slowly hit ground ball toward third. 
Backhanding Arenado is throw low, picked by Goldschmidt at first base. Suzuki is out. Good play on both ends. Gold Glovers at third and first retire Suzuki, leaving Morrell on. Here is Nolan Arenado. And that one out towards left center, Ortega sliding, and he makes the catch. Nice play, Rafael Ortega covering the ground, and he steals a hit from Nolan Arenado. Eight in a row, set down by Stroman. Put in play, back to Stroman. Underhands in a 1-2-3 inning. That's 11 in a row set down by Marcus Stroman. We're scoreless. And it's Brandon Hughes. The lefty is in. Stroman went seven. Retired the final 11 that he saw. Edmund a base hit. Extra bases for Tommy. The go-ahead run at second base. Albert Pujols, 694 career home runs. The script that we imagined earlier, John, has been set up here in the bottom of the eighth inning for Albert. Albert hits one a ton! Deep left! It is gone! 695! They pitch to him, and they get burned! His final at bat against the Cubs! A pinch hit, two-run homer! You've got to be kidding me! Unbelievable! Six, nine, five! You know he's going to get a curtain call. What a great moment here at Bush Stadium. True to the script, Albert Pujols homers in his final game against the Chicago Cubs. Ryan Helsley is into the ball game. 1-1. Hit up the middle, off of Helsley. Could be two, a step on the back, double play. It's a sweep of the Cubs. In his final at bat against Chicago, Albert Pujols with a pinch hit, two run homer. The Cardinals, a shutout, two to nothing. I mean, what else can you say, Danny? Wow, we, what a homer. Miles Michaelis, eight innings, two hits. So much fun. This place, like you said, is electric. Panachase is presented by Roman, the official men's digital health clinic of Major League Baseball.